Hi, I'm Jordan Crane and I'm a certified ethical hacker. Enumeration uh, is basically a process that involves establishing a, an active connection to a target host. And those connections can lead to further exploitation further down the road, but the initial part of uh, enumeration is in the first steps of, of, of hacking, which is the information gathering stage. The enumeration part to me is, is, is one of the, the funner parts of what we do. Uh, for me, being on the blue team side of things, I'll refer to that a lot because red team and, and hacking goes hand in hand, but a lot of times we don't really emphasize how much, uh, the hacking portion of it benefits the other side of it, the blue team for the defensive end. So we use a lot of those same tools on the defensive end and for the enumeration part, it's something that goes in hand in hand. So, um, very important on both ends. And, uh, like I said, the initial part of the information gathering. So with enumeration, what things have helped me in my position is the network enumeration. And that would be the part of, uh, you know, widely used Nmap so that we can do port scans to see what open ports are out there that shouldn't be open. And in our organization, we're always looking to see with scans that we do to make sure that no open ports are on the network that shouldn't be. Um, by establishing active connections to our own hosts, we can then prevent or mitigate if there's anything that we see that shouldn't be there. So um, for helping fortify, secure your own network, and on the flip side for the red teaming, it's basically network enumeration using Nmap as a tool is probably the, the most widely used tool to where we can initiate scans for the purpose of determining if hosts are alive. Uh, we can deep dive deeper into fingerprinting and that is the first step of the process. My knowledge of enumeration significantly increased after taking the CEH exam and, and sitting through the course. Uh, probably specifically, I should say, for the types of enumeration that uh, I could perform on the network. And uh, primarily, as I've mentioned before, network enumeration is, was a big part, but jumping into different types of enumerations such as SNMP so we can determine whether or not uh, version 2 or version 3 is running uh, SNMP uh, to, to determine if it's secure or not. Um, SMTP, we can query the mail servers to see if they're alive, uh, how many users are on that mail server, so on and so forth. Uh, NetBIOS, we can query across the Windows devices to see what devices are out there. Um, a, a slew of different enumeration types that uh, I knew the protocols, I knew the terminology, but didn't know how to apply it until after taking the course. And that has greatly benefited me. So roles on the team that need to know and understand enumeration. Uh, just looking back for what I do as a IT supervisor, I have a couple specialists that deal specifically with the network and security side of things. So uh, they need to take an active role in performing types of enumeration gathering information on our networks to make sure that 
there is no services that should shouldn't be running on the network. There are uh, types of protocols that are old, outdated, not secure that can be identified with enumeration. So very important for for all of the team that I work with to be conscious of enumeration and how to utilize it to, to better secure our networks. Tips or tricks for enumeration? That's a, a very good question. So I probably would refer to taking the CEH course in order to learn uh, more in-depth knowledge of, of enumeration and, and how that process helps you with ethical hacking. As for tips and tricks, it's really just going out there and testing out the waters. So if you don't know what Nmap is, download it, install it, command line, or they have a GUI version but start using it make sure to do it ethically but the the trick and tip is to get out there on the front lines start using the tools so that you can become familiar with them and the road to learning that will come as you go down that path